Sharing Tracy's uh, special St. Patrick's Day meal. Um, it's corned beef and cabbage, but we ran into a couple problems. We, I got saw the uh, the cabbage and the lettuce. I didn't know which was which, so I got her the sauerkraut because I know that is cabbage for sure. So I know that way I, I can't go wrong there. So we're gonna have corned beef and cabbage. Oh my gosh! Really? <laughs> Holy cow! That's really on there. Hey, Louie, see if you can get that while I. <laughs> All right, Louis is going to help me with uh, that. As One condition, you stay away from my sister. I'll stay away from your sister. Do you want not no <laughs> All right. Thank you, sir. All right. And um, and then corned beef. So I got her the corned beef or the corned beef and cabbage. So uh, here we go. I'm making it. Uh, all right. So, okay. So um, I've, since I've never made this before, um, I'm going to go with the uh, corned beef on top, I hope. All right. Boy, it feels like... I do want to who it looks like. Hmm. So there's the corned beef. I'll put that in there. All right. Then put in the cabbage, a la the, the, the ferment cabbage. And so here is your corned beef and cabbage. All right. Now I'm going to put that into the microwave. Uh, okay. Mix it up so it gets it gets in there good. Okay. So this is uh, Tracy Taylor's corned beef and cabbage. <coughs> you mean, oh my gosh, that smells delightful. The thing, it's not a uh, as you could, you'd think I'd know how to work, work this better. Okay, uh, start, um, cook. No, power, timer, no. <laughs> there we go, hooray! <laughs> All right, so uh, now we'll, we'll, we'll have to fast motion this part as it goes to a minute. So, there we go. Um, oh, I'm so glad this is not smelly because this stuff stinks.